Hi guys, welcome to another Living in a Slate TV video. David here. Today I'm going to show you the most luxurious hotel that you can find here in Johannesburg, right here in Santon, and the name is called The Saxon. Don't you believe me? Stay tuned because once again, this video will blow your mind. Today we are continue to show you the best out of the luxury in South Africa and we couldn't do that without talking about the magnificent Saxon in Santon. The Saxon Hotel was once the home of insurance magnate Dostein who envisioned a 5 star hotel for his old residents. And if it's the first time they you are watching this channel don't forget to check the whole full tour that i did on stain city okay guys to give you guys an idea of how big this property is we have 10 hectares or 10 football fields the construction of this house was done in 1989 it became an hotel in 1999 and in 2008 they started to build the villas to prepare themselves for the world cup in 2010 they have 53 rooms a spa the three villas, a restaurant, three pools, gym, lots of parking, and the list goes on and on. And I'm telling you guys, this hotel for me is valued in more than 100 million rand or even more. And why am I saying that this hotel is so, so amazing, so different from others? Guys, I have literally been in most of the hotels in Gauteng. And I can tell you straight away, the service given here, it's just amazing, you know. Uh, everything started uh, when uh, me and my wife, uh, we wanted to do something different. So we, we thought about doing a high tea. So we went for the experience and we were really amazed, which I will show you guys more uh, up front on this video. But, the, you know, the whole attention to detail is just magnificent. But uh, let me tell you guys more. Okay, let me tell you guys a few things why this hotel is so special and a little bit of the history behind it. For example, Nelson Mandela, a Stain family friend, took time out to edit his autobiography, A Long Walk to Freedom, right here at the Saxon, for example. The Global Citizen Festival in 2018 Entrance. brought to Joburg Beyonce, Jay-Z and Chris Martin, which is the lead singer for Coldplay, which stay all of them Hello. at this exact hotel. Another very interesting thing was um, also the Clintons have been around. A lot of African personalities, celebrities have also stayed at the Saxon. And for example, Oprah Winfrey, uh, the Saxon was her home away while in Joburg. At one stage, she even had her own office at the hotel when she was launching her school in South Africa. Okay, some great things to say about the service. When you arrive, expect to be greeted by name. From the pleasant greets to the attention paid to every minute detail of your stay. It says, though, nothing is too much for the Saxon crew. They also provide masks, wet wipes, and make you feel at ease, which is so true. So, despite being surrounded by five-star luxury, you will see many casually dressed guests comfortably hanging out at the hotel's two swimming pools set amid lush gardens and ponds of extremely healthy-looking koi. And there are usually plenty of regulars who enjoy lunch or drinks on the terrace, which is also the name of the outside restaurant. No, this is simply amazing. Okay guys, let's talk about the high tea experience. Morning and afternoon tea is an elegant, time-honored tradition and a specialty of the Saxons. The piano lounge offers a classy atmosphere, making it the ideal spot for catching up with friends over a cup of expertly brewed tea. Relax and savour the delicious meal 
which now includes a separate vegan and vegetarian option. The pastry kitchen's handcrafted sumptuous delights will be the perfect complement to your morning or afternoon tea experience. Whether you favor savory or sweet foods, each tiny bite-sized delight is made to the team's exacting standards with only the finest imported and okay. local ingredients. So I'll start off by saying more than welcome to order any tea that you do know of that is not part of my selection here. And then you can also order any coffee. Let's say you order a cappuccino, a cafe latte or an americano. It can come on a syrup flavor which is a vanilla, a cinnamon, a caramel and a macadamia nut. Then I'll explain the teas to you. All our teas at the Sazi are from Ronafault. It's a company in Germany established in 1823. It makes it the oldest tea house in the world and this is a premium selection that they've chosen for us at the Sazi for our high tea. And they only deal with the five-star establishment only. Over here, I've got the Darjeeling Springtime. The reason why they call it Darjeeling Springtime it is indeed harvested in Darjeeling and it's also harvested in springtime. Mm -hmm. This is a black tea, however, it's a very strong black tea. We always recommend it with milk mm -hmm. because it's very strong. Mm -hmm. Second tea on our tea selection, it's a splendid Earl Grey. Mm -hmm. As the name suggests, it is indeed splendid. It is a beautiful bergamot, which is a lemony citrusy. Mm -hmm. It's good for the hair, it's good for the skin. If you want to look 21 forever, that's the tea to help. Personally, I also don't recommend it with milk because I feel like the milk takes away the aromatic mm -hmm. flavors of the tea. Third tea on our tea selection, it's a superior oolong tea. A superior oolong tea, it's a mixture of two teas. It's a mixture of a black tea and a green tea. However, with this one, it leans more on the greener side. With honey, you got to go. Fourth tea on our tea selection, it's also my favorite. It's a white yin long tea. The white yin long tea, it's a white tea from China. Centuries ago, only the royal family from China used to drink this tea, however it's now part of our Renafold collection. It is a slightly nutty aftertaste, I believe it goes very well with your sweets. And what's beautiful about this tea, it's hand picked, hand rolled, pan fried, it didn't go to any machine at all. Last tea on our tea selection, it's a dragon wall Xiang tea, this is the green tea. If you're a green tea drinker, you're definitely going to enjoy this one. And it is a little bit of jasmine, aromatic, it's a beautiful tea. May I offer you energies? I'm going to have the white yen long, please. Yeah. So the teas will put them right in front of you. Mm -hmm. What you have on, sir? Try that one, David. She says it goes. Ah, let's, give it, let's give it a try. The white? Yes. So the teas will put them in front of you. I've got my boiling water. Mm -hmm. I've got my timer here. It's a three minutes timer. Anything after three minutes, they consider it bad tea. Another detail that I want to mention is this place is really big. So if you want to go, for example, from the restaurant to the villas, they will provide you transportation inside of the property itself. Okay guys, so let me tell you about this detail that will blow your minds. You see these koi fish on the pool, right? We got two pools, small fish and big koi fish, right? To give you guys an idea, Japanese people have been breeding koi fish since the 1700s. And koi fish breeding is a very exact science and selective breeding. To give you guys an idea, a koi fish, a proper koi fish, goes for hundreds of thousands of dollars. Why? One of these little things that you can see here in front of you, the record fee that was paid for one, not this specific one, but in another country, was $1.8 million. Remarkable. Why? The size, the color grade, the color scheme, uh, the gracefulness of how it swims. Those are a few things or a few factors that qualify koi fish for such a big amount of money. So next time you will see koi fish, guys, Think about it, hundreds of thousands of dollars. Those specific ones in this pool can go for a heck a lot of money. These people in this hotel, they know what they are doing.
Ok guys, let's enter the magnificent Nelson Mandela Platinum Suite via glass enclosed elevator and let's have an experience like no other. The rooms are pure luxury, with private balconies, king-size mattresses, a his and hers bathroom counter that justifies having a phone put on the wall as you shout out across the distance to your plus one, and a lavishly sized bath and rain shower. The mini bar is filled at no extra charge, a smart step that all hotels should emulate. That there is an assortment of food on hand in case you become hungry in between meals. Just, just amazing. The top suite's regal African decor exemplifies the Saxon's charm and grace. The entrance, guest bathroom, guest suite, separate lounge, dining room and office space with business desks are all included in this majestic suite. There is a king-size bed in the master bedroom as well as a separate bathroom with a separate bath walk-in shower and a steam room. A fully equipped butler's kitchen is available, as well as a 24-hour butler service. The garden and pool deck are visible from the suite. Check-in in suite, complimentary breakfast, full minibar and snacks, high-speed Wi-Fi, in-room entertainment, use of spa hydro amenities, a bottle of French champagne on arrival, fully equipped butler's kitchen, a VIP airport meet and greet and return transfer in Mercedes-Benz vehicle, access to fitness center. It's so amazing, really. Top-notch service. There's always a gentle buzz of chatter on the patio rather than the hushed tones of a place taking itself too seriously. And it, this is so correct because you can chill here. I don't know if you guys know this, but the most expensive place to stay in a hotel is here at the Saxon, which is called the Nelson Mandela Suite. And uh, it costs exactly 75,000 Rand per night or
Okay, as you can see, this so this is a presidential suite, which is twenty four thousand per night. The one that we saw previously was around ten thousand eight hundred per night. kitchen here and of course we'll connect to this living room ah oh, there you go <laughs> And of course, this video was done in two different days. So the first day we did a high tea, which was a wonderful uh, weather, which was raining, which made the experience very romantic and everlasting, of course. The second one, we actually tried the restaurant. So we had, let's say, a very good experience overall the two times that we went there. An ongoing endeavor to ensure that guests of the Saxon live with a lasting impression of a sheer comfort, luxury and a polished and friendly service. This is embedded into the staff's character. And this is very true. A very interesting thing is that the Saxon also has another brother, which is called the Shambhala Private Game Reserve. Shambhala is situated on almost 10,000 hectares in the Lopompo province so it's like a saxon but on a private safari now imagine must be awesome okay so besides the guests that the saxon had the cv goes far beyond than that you know in terms of awards they have the world's leading boutique hotel since 2001 the diners club international wine list awards 2018 icon award American Express Dining Awards 2018 and 2019, World's Best Wine Lists Awards, Best Spirits List in Middle East and Africa, and South Africa Leading Boutique Hotel in 2018.
Yes. Okay guys, so thank you very much for watching, I hope you guys enjoy, you guys subscribe and destroy that like button and I will see you in the next Living in a SATV video.